back again with another kind of music video reaction. My name is Josh. Thanks for checking out the channel. If you click the thumbnail, we're going to check out some more Shibuzi. Shibuzi is an artist that I'm getting more familiar with. I actually just kind of stumbled upon him as one of his new songs came out. And I believe you guys told me to check him out. And I had to check out. It was a bar song. And the, the song was just so catchy. And it just burned into my subconscious. And I've been listening to it ever since. And I've absolutely loved it. Other than that, I think I've only been able to hear one other song of his. Like Let It Burn. It was also a really good song. But one that just popped up is another visualizer. Like the Shibuzi one that I listened to first. And this one's called My Fault. Featuring Noah Cyrus. So... Let's go ahead and check it out. I've been down for those couple songs I've heard, so kind of excited for anything else coming out. Let's do it. Is it my fault you're lost? It's hard for me to see you when you try in a bathroom style. Taking pills, giving up. You're trying to find your friends, but it's too dark. Tell me how y'all getting home. Took the car Call me for you passed out in the yard Feeling low, getting high Where did everything go wrong? You say that it's the universe And blame it on the stars Yeah, I can only handle heartache When it's burden in my hand If I had to relive all the hard days I would do it all again I'm getting better at the bar games should have been a better man, so don't you keep on trying to fix me. You've done everything you can, but this road you led me down is too long. It ain't nothing like the streets I grew up on. When I beg you not to go, you leave again. Well, I guess I wasn't enough in the end. Is it my fault? Very sad, very depressing, but at the same time, it sounded so wonderful. Like Shibuzi, he can sing. He does tend to use a little twang of like auto tune in there, 
but it really kind of works because it separates itself a little bit from pretty much any of the other country music that I've heard. But if that was Noah Cyrus there, she sings wonderfully as well. And their voices together. I admittedly have a soft spot for duets, especially male-female duets. And this one, man, that one just, you know, it pulls on the old heartstrings too. I mean, it's the way it was sung. It really kind of pulls you into that where there's been a couple artists recently actually that I've heard that they're singing about their life experiences and they, they do it so well. It pulls you in and feels like it's your experiences and your memories. And, and I think that's the sign of a good artist and very powerful artist. And that's exactly what this did for me. I mean, it's again, it sounds so beautiful. And like, I'm probably going to be singing parts of the chorus not that long from now. And then I'm going to be like, oh, yeah, this is kind of a sad song, <laughs> but I'm still going to enjoy the music. But that was that was fabulous. Again, I was I didn't know if I was going to expect kind of happy-go-lucky with like, you know, a bar song or something more like this. I mean, Let It Burn was also a little sadder, but also kind of inspirational. This one was just kind of sad, but sounded wonderful. I don't know. Let me know what you guys thought. Let me know if you know any context behind this song and which other ones I need to check out by Shibuzi and or Noah. Let me know, please, because they both sounded fantastic. Don't forget, like, share, subscribe. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you would, that'd be fantastic. And as always, you're awesome. Peace out.